a day fit for a legend of the sport. The 2014 IndyCar season fired up in Sunsplash St. Petersburg, Florida with the Grand Prix of St. Petersburg. The field coming to green behind A.J. Foyt's Honda-powered 14 car, wheeled to the pole Saturday by Takuma Sato. Sato was quick in the first third of the race, leading by five seconds at one point, swapping the top spot with eventual winner Will Power after a pit stop exchange. Ultimately, changing track conditions would end his bid for victory. Sato had to settle for seventh. The race ran caution-free until the late stages, but two Honda hopes, Marco Andretti and rookie Jack Hawksworth, saw their chances undone on a restart tangle. Honda's honors on this day would go to former IndyCar champ Ryan hunter Ray, who climbed to second late after a strong pass of Helio Castroneves. We're really proud of, uh, of what Honda gave us out there to fight. Um, you know, we came, we came from as far back as fifth at one point to finish second, so pretty happy with that. We matched Will's pace at the end, just didn't have it for him to, to pass. So um, we, we fought with Elio there, got by him, and uh, good points heading into uh, Long Beach, and, and we'll see where that goes. And a very solid day for Simon Pagano in the Schmidt-Peterson Racing Honda-powered 77 car, a top five to begin a possible title drive. We saved a lot of fuel and uh, managed to gain a lot of spot uh, in the pit stop sequence. Um, the car was very good. We just uh, never got uh, clean air to, to show it. but. Uh, Fuel mileage was fantastic from the Honda engine, and uh, well, it's great. We've got uh, Ryan on the podium and myself here, so uh, two Honda in the top five is really good. One of the day's surprises was young gun Joseph Newgarden. Qualifying struggles forced him to come from the back of the pack to record a nice ninth. It was all about uh, saving the tires, and I think the Honda power plant actually helped me save my tires really well. I, I felt like I was doing a better job than everyone around me saving tires, and that was really big today. So, um, yeah, the Honda's strong. You know, they, they've done a great job in the offseason. It's been fun to work on, and I think we're going to be looking good going into the next races. Honda's IndyCar teams will have two weeks to regroup before bidding for victory in Long Beach. For Honda Racing HPD Trackside, I'm Rick Benjamin in St. Petersburg.